Welcome back to Wells Fargo Friday here on Valley Life. And Michelle, I want to uh, kind of get into it. Michael was, uh, before we left the last segment, was, was singing your praises as your involvement is not just a store manager with Wells Fargo, but then when you're on the board and you get involved, there's other programs that you can kind of really put in yourself in the mix so that any dollars that are, that are garnered towards the United Way get the most effective treatment and the most efficient treatment to help people in our community. Well, I'm very privileged to and honored to serve on the board of United Way of Fresno County. Um, they do a lot of wonderful things, and I'm also fortunate that Wells Fargo gives me the opportunity to do that. One of the projects that we're really excited about right now is around the Spark Point Financial Center that's going to okay. be opening um, in April. And uh, Wells Fargo was a uh, part founder in that process and uh, provided a $100,000 grant that I was fortunate enough to be able to present to the United Way to help kick off and spearhead um, what is going to be a just an incredible uh, financial resource for our community. Sure, and there are all, I mean, that's a tremendous amount of money, and there's still even more different little grants and things that you you jump right in to help facilitate so that more money keeps coming in. And then, of course, while there are volunteers in the community, people that are watching even that want to get involved, their dollars are really going to go a long way when they join partners with Wells Fargo and commit it to the United Way. Absolutely, and I think that part of the fundraising is definitely a very important part, and uh, United Way also tries to really encourage that all the uh, Fresnans that come in and volunteer and get involved because the human resources are just as important as the financial ones. Sure, and then Michael, once the money is uh, coming to United Way and it's in your hands, right. it can really really go a long way to help the community let me give you just some statistics that we just got today as far as Wells Fargo and then I'll talk about one other area uh, they've provided in financial counseling eight workshops uh, they've had that's over 64 hours their volunteers have given to give financial uh, education and support to the community that's in need the individuals they've also helped with spark point where they've given four meetings two hours each, so about eight hours to help us get it ready. So they've been a tremendous uh, asset to our organization, but the community. And luckily we have great partners just like Wells Fargo that are out there really understanding the need and moving ahead. Sure. And instead of me just backing you guys into a corner over here, if you want to move this way with me a little bit, I think people are going to understand exactly what you've grown into and the resources that are available too and all the cubicles back here, people that are helping out financially. And that is tremendous in the community because then instead of just, you know, handing some money to somebody kind of like giving a man a fish, you know, instead of teaching him how to fish and feed it for a lifetime, putting these financial tools in place really ends up keeping that drop just continuing to happen when people are already economically distressed. I mean, you're really pulling people out of the bottom. Yes, and this is exactly the goal and the objective of the Spark Point Financial Center is that we will be able to serve and help all the families within the Fresno community um, and Central Valley community and invite them to come in to get the type of financial coaching that they need so that they can get on that road to economic success. Sure. And Michael, that becomes that much more pertinent because right now, uh, time is of the essence, we're in the middle of tax season. That's right. Uh, just some statistics I got last night. We've done 4,139 tax returns by volunteers trained for 32 hours and certified by the IRS. Okay. Uh, we've brought back $6 million into the community just in that period of two months of doing tax returns. And then for the earn income earned tax credit, that's about uh, $4,044,000 that gives the people a chance to get that money back into their pockets to help with their family, but also gives money to uh, spend in our community so everybody benefits by it. So it's a great organization in the sense that uh, it's by volunteers who are dedicated to helping the community. Sure. When you hear about uh, the budget woes of not just the city or the county or the state or even the country, uh, millions of dollars. You're not talking just, uh, you know, chump change here at a few bucks. Millions of dollars. This is a direct, very focused impact. That's right. And if you look at our uh, Spark Point Center here, is we have a area where kids can be when their family come in for either tax returns or counseling on their right. their what's going on in their own financial well-being uh, they have we have private cubicles here where people can sit and in confidence be able to talk and then we'll have our vita in the back where we can do tax returns because those can be done uh, during the year so it's really exciting how the community has come together to support us wells fargo has been a tremendous uh, partner in that and uh, i know the community is excited because as you look at the tax returns through vita we have lines lined up every day here and all of our community organizations that are providing it that are really uh, seeing the need that people have. They just don't have the dollars to pay for that tax return. And they're not getting all the benefit back by doing 
the a correct tax return. Sure. Well, I appreciate it, both of your time, uh, and especially Michelle, you know, for volunteering and throwing that extra into it. Uh, it's saying a lot about uh, your character, Wells Fargo, and the United Way, and all the help that it's doing for the community. So I sure appreciate it. Thank you so much. Oh well, thank you. It's my pleasure. And the more people that can come out and volunteer and give some time, um, it's so it's so rewarding. And so I just encourage everybody to get involved and come out and be a part of any organization that's going to help our community. Beautiful. So jump on that bandwagon. Catch the spirit, make it happen. Your volunteerism jumped in with Wells Fargo and the United Way is a tremendous impact right here on our own community. And they're making it happen right here at Wells Fargo Fridays. More Valley Life right after this. Uh -huh.